Hey y'all, it's your girl I'm back. So we didn't do much vlogging today because we were out grocery shopping. Look, that's a lot with kids. So I decided to do a grocery haul. We went to Sam's Club, Kroger, and Walmart. My budget is $150 a week on just regular food. And then once a month, I do like a $100 necessity, like household type stuff budget. And it's supposed to be like at the beginning of the month, but you know, like most of the time, like the end, the last week of a month. And that's, I think I just told you $100 and I didn't spend all of that. But my food budget, I think I came under at, I think $2 this week. So yeah, let's get into this video. So we have the 200 count box of, what are these? Trash bags. This is my first time trying them. They were a good buy. They were like $14 and some change. And normally I get the, what is it called? Husky brand from Walmart. You only get like 144 in there for I think like 13 something. So that's why I got this one. We shall see. And it is the Power Flex. And I think it has a smell to it. Right? I thought it did. Maybe not. But I thought I seen it say something about a smell. I mean, if it doesn't have a smell, that's fine. My other ones don't, so that is fine with me. And y'all know I've been on this asparagus kick for months now. I can literally eat this every day. And Sam's Club has them on sale. Last week and this week, they were on sale for, I think, like, 302 322 something like that. So, I got two packages because, literally, last week I went through a whole pack, and this is a two... Excuse me, this is a two pound pack. Two, yeah, two pound pack, and I went through it in like two days. So, got two of those, and then we have the two bags of fruity pebbles. That was it at Sam's Club. Babe, how much was it at Sam's Club? 14 something for the stuff at Sam's. Everything? No, for the, the food and. I think the food was 14 something, right? Or 13 something. 13 or 14 something. And then the, oh, so maybe the food was 12. Okay, he said 29 total at Sam's Club. So this is what we got. So over here in this corner is my Kroger haul. I've never tried this one, the Miracle Whip with olive oil. I'm making chicken salad, and honestly, I don't eat a lot of Miracle Whip anymore, so I didn't want to spend three, almost four dollars for a big thing of Miracle Whip just to make chicken salad, and this was on closeout for some reason for like a dollar seventy nine. So, and it doesn't expire till June, and I'm gonna use it like in a couple of days. So, yeah, we're gonna try the Miracle Whip made with olive oil. Yeah, I don't know if this is a Texas thing or what, but sandwich spread. If y'all don't eat sandwich spread, try it. It's banging. My husband don't like it, but it's really good. One chicken breast, it was $4.04. One lobster tail. Some, what is this? Leafy romaine lettuce blend. Some Ritz crackers for the chicken salad some brown gravy, some ranch. Okay, <laughs> I'm recording, okay. Y'all know I got kids, honey, work with me. When we just got home. Some Hidden Valley Ranch um, dressed and mix because I decided to make my own ranch this week because none of the other ranch sounded good at the store. Some mashed potatoes for the kids. They love these little instant bags and this is big enough for them. A can of mixed nuts for Mookie. I've been wanting pickles and Kool-Aid, so I got a jar of pickles for me and some Kool-Aid somewhere over there. Some celery. Denise requested a pineapple and a cantaloupe. She just had cantaloupe at her nana house the other day. I mean, we eat it every so often, but because she had it the other day at nana house, she's like, uh, I want some more. So cantaloupe, pineapple, gala apples. The Granny Smith apples didn't look too good today, so we left them there. 
um, avocados and some pears. And I don't remember. I, <laughs> I don't remember my total at Kroger, but again, I stayed within my budget, and I was actually like two dollars under budget. So, no. How much did I spend at Kroger? I want to say it's like forty something dollars. Don't quote me it down that. Um, if I still have the receipt, I'll sure insert it here. Okay. Yeah, so from the soy milk all the way down, this is my Walmart haul. Now this was my kind of my last store, so I think I remember my total was like ninety dollars and some change. So we have two cartons of soy milk. The, what is it? Great Value Organic Apple Cider Vinegar with the mother in it. At Walmart, I just get this one. I prefer the Bragg's, but Walmart never has theirs on sale. Normally, I get it from my Kroger or Whole Foods or Sprouts. But I didn't go to Whole Foods or Sprouts, and I forgot to check Kroger to see if they had it on sale. So, whenever you don't want to buy the Bragg's one full price at Walmart, get this one. Yeah. Um, some tomatoes. Y'all know I got to have my big red. Some dairy-free Ben and Jerry's. What is it? Chocolate fudge brownie. That's Mookie's ice cream. I wanted some ice cream. I have bluebells, cookies, and cream. And hold on real quick while I put the ice cream in the freezer. Okay. And you know, my kids love these turkey sausages. The brownie serve. So they have two packages of those. These are on clearance, sale, whatever. The veggies, spirals, and there's zucchini. Mookie wants to try them, so we got those. Amani is saying, hey, hey. Hey. Um, three ammonias. I was looking at something, and they was talking about how you have so many germs in your clothes, and the laundry detergent doesn't kill the germs and all that good stuff. And I knew that already. That's why I normally... I use ammonia in my darks and of course bleach in my whites. But um I seen something about some sanit money. Get out. Okay. I seen something about some sanitized stuff by Clorox. Yeah. That stuff was a ridiculous price. So now I'm just gonna stick with my old faithful all purpose clear ammonia. Sometimes I get the lemon scent. I just kinda rotate. So I got three of those. Some jumbo shrimp, some omega-3 vitamins, um, my deodorant, this toilet bowl cleaner, y'all, is kid and pet friendly. I don't have pets, but we do have small kids who used to play in the toilet, so this used to be my go-to toilet bowl, like cleanser, deodorizer, or whatever. And, you know, it keeps your toilet blue, but it doesn't have all those harsh chemicals in it. And it's only 84 cents at Walmart. So, we got two of those. I think we're going to get rid of the twins' potties and just keep them on the regular toilet now. So, we're going to need another one of these. Um, some milk. I don't know how that's going to work, folks. I do not know how going to work. We'll see. Well, I don't think we're going to try that tonight because I don't have the energy, but tomorrow... We will do that. Um, Y'all know, so everybody knows, Mookie is vegan. We all consume soy milk around here, but when I'm making like macaroni and cheese, which I am this week, I like to use regular cow's milk. When I'm eating a lot of cereal, I like to use cow's milk because I like to drink the milk after I eat the cereal, and I will not do that with soy milk. So... Normally, I buy the half gallon, and we have a lot of cereal right now, and I'm craving cereal. So, I went ahead and got the whole gallon, and I think I need milk for something else that I'm cooking. Don't remember. So, got that. Because I know y'all like, wait a minute. Y'all don't drink that. Yeah. That's why we have that. <sighs> Bugles, because I wanted it. Y'all, it's the time of the month, and you're going to notice that I got stuff that it probably seem crazy, but I really wanted it. So, the nacho bugles. Um, our regular French roast dark coffee we normally get. These hot fries are for the kids. They don't eat this kind of stuff often at home. Um, normally if they have something like this, it's at my mama house. But I went ahead and 
um, had Mookie to get them a bag of chips that they're just gonna eat snack on tomorrow. Um, yeah, now I made my dining room table. This fully wooden, and this week I am going to uh, what is it called? Staining and stuff. So I do need these guards because I do still have small kids. The twins are two, and they'll be three. But the way they run around corners. I want to always make sure that they're safe. So we got these. And these things are expensive, y'all. <sighs> Mookie and the kids love their kettle corn popcorn. I've been craving some steak. Um, so I'm going to eat steak and lobster together. The kids love steak too, so they'll probably have steak also. And we'll probably have like some green beans or asparagus with that. Got some green beans. I'm going to make a little small thing of gumbo. So we got some okra and seasoning blend. Told you I want Kool-Aid, Kool-Aid white. Literally, I want to put a little bit of sugar in this package with this Kool-Aid. Mix it up and then sprinkle it on the pickle as I eat it. Oh my God, I used to do this as a child and I haven't had this in years. I don't even know the last time I had Kool-Aid. Hopefully, I'm okay. Last time I drank Kool-Aid, it made me nauseous, but I don't plan on drinking it. So I'm just going to eat it. So we shall see. We have some large llama beans for Mookie. So his favorite kind bars. Great northern beans. What are these? Light red kidney beans. Couscous. Some margarine. Because this ain't butter. I know people be like butter, but this ain't butter. Okay. This is margarine. But hey, whatever. Some halos. And y'all, yeah, again. I really wanted some chocolate covered pecans actually, but I had to settle for these and they are really good. They were kind of pricey, but good. I'm telling you, this is interesting. Me and this PMS is real good. But, but got these for myself. But not, last but not least, I forgot to mention about me going to Target. Um, I told y'all, PMS in that time of month, I needed my go to. I used the Cora brand. I already had some, so I just picked up another box. And I used to get the multi box that's half regular, half super. But because I want to try these, the soft disc, I just got this little small one of the tampons. And I already have pads because I buy like the big, big bag of organic pads. So I didn't need any more pads, but needed those. I'm trying to get to using a menstrual cup so i figured let me get the menstrual disc down first and then it should be easy to use the cup i don't know if that makes sense but i am definitely going to try because i'm over using tampons i've been in, i switched to using organic only organic okay i switched to using only organic um tampons and pads probably about almost a year ago and i have noticed a big big difference but i really just want to go to menstrual cups so i'm gonna try these this okay y'all so that is the end of our grocery haul um I, at target i spent 20 18 dollars and some change and it again comes out of like my household miscellaneous budget and i think that is it I love you guys. Hope you enjoyed this haul. I didn't get water because if you can, I don't think you can see it, but it's literally a 40 pack water right there that Mookie just brought home literally like I think yesterday. So we didn't need water and if we need some later on in the week, which I know we will, um, I'll just send him to the store to get some. But yeah, that is the end of this video. We love you guys. See y'all in the morning. Holla.